with Tim Bailey of Williams Baptist College. Tim, how's it going? It's going great. Awesome. Thank you so much for being here. Yes, sir. Tim, um, obviously, I'm going to take you for a little bit of training a lot this season. This has been a tough season for you. Yes, sir. Tell us a little bit about your preparation for tonight's Well, um, I'm battling from a, a, with a broken hand. I broke my hand last Saturday at a tournament, 56th place match. And I wasn't really sure if I was going to be able to come back, you know, full 100%. But today I just I gave it my all. I came up short in overtime, but you know I'm not really uh, I'm not really mad at my performance. Okay. Tim, um, you know, like with the sport of wrestling, it teaches you a lot of values, such as you know uh, bouncing back and, and not staying on the mat and just getting back up. Yes. For someone that uh, is new to sport of wrestling, tell us what it means to you. It means it means everything to me. Like it's just it, it's just. You tell yourself you're not gonna let this guy pin you. You tell yourself you're gonna you're gonna give it your all. It's just it's it's more it's it's a mental game really. Like you can have big, strong, muscular guys and go up against a small five, but if the small five believes it more and, and wants it more and and shows it and has a little win, he's gonna win every time. Absolutely. And speaking of overcoming the mental Normally wrestle 141. Yes, sir. Not you wrestle up a weight class 149. Yes, sir. Uh, was that a tough transition for you? No, sir. I just I believed in myself. I you know I had I didn't even let my broken hand get to me. I I, I had faith in myself. I had faith in my coaching from Coach Regner, wonderful coach. I just I believed in myself. Like I said, I came up short, but I, I can't be mad. Absolutely, Tim. The season is strong here. Uh, it's a near close, but. Um, just coach set up at the beginning of the week pretty much what you just said nationals is coming up he told us to, to, to become strict with our regimen like going to class not not just with wrestling going to class and eating right just become strict push yourself a little more we're going to have all our life to eat McDonald's, you know, from time to time. So we can cut all that, that stuff out now. And I, as for me, I just want to heal up to the, to the best way I can, you know, with, with my hand. So. What other goals do you have going on Yes, yes. I, I, I believe I can win. I believe I can win. If, you know, if I don't, I, I, I believe I'm going to be an All-American. Awesome. Tim, um, going in, now this season's almost out. Nationals come up. What plans do you have for next year? Next year, well, this summer, uh, I'm, I'm from uh, I'm from Pittsburgh, so this summer I'm planning on training with a, a pit wrestling team. So, in preparation for next year, you know, wrestling never stops. If if it, if, if you stop at the end of the season, you're gonna you're gonna go nowhere. Ne you're not gonna go anywhere next season. So, thank you so much. Thank you, sir.
sites are always at the top, you know, we're looking for great gold medals. And, uh, and the top of the podium. And we're going to stay strict and discipline and keep working hard. And we might not have uh, the most experience as a team, we're only first year program, but I guarantee we're working hard and we're going to work harder than most programs. Thank you. 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 Thank you.